I am Anil Kumar and in this video we will do some calculations to understand radian measurements and angular velocity. The question here is if diameter of a monster truck tire is 3.5 meters and it makes one rotation in every five seconds what is the angle of rotation in radians in one second? What is the period? Calculate the angular velocity and calculate linear velocity as the wheel travels. So you need to answer these questions for the given situation. You can pause the video, answer and then look into my suggestion. So what we have here is that the diameter of the truck tire is 3.5 and it makes one rotation in 5 seconds. So, so it goes through one full circle, one full circle in 5 seconds. Part A is, what is the angle of rotation in radians in one second? Now since it makes one full circle in five seconds, in one second, the angle should be one-fifth, correct? So we say in five seconds, the angle is how much? So we say angle is equals to two pi, right? Since two pi is one circle, right? full circle let me write now in one second it should be 2 pi divided by 5 so that much is the angle which is in radians so so that is the answer what is the angle of rotation in one second it is 2 pi by 5 radians okay next question is what is the period now for this movement we know time is let me use another ink we can say that the time is equal to uh, one rotation in one second correct so what is the period so time period for this is five seconds since one rotation takes five seconds so that's the straightforward question Calculate the angular velocity. Now, angular velocity omega is, you can calculate in radians per second or revolutions in per second, right? So, we will calculate angular velocity in radians per second, right? In this case, what we see is that there is one rotation in five seconds. So, in one rotation, how much angle do we cover? So, we say omega equals to one revolution. We say one revolution in 5 seconds correct one revolution is 2 pi radians and we have 5 seconds and therefore the angular velocity is 2 pi over 5 radians per second correct the last question here is calculate linear velocity as the wheel travels now what is the relation between angular and linear velocity Linear velocity v is radius. So we can write v equals to omega times radius. The radius for this tire is half of 3.5. So radius is equals to 3.5 which is a diameter divided by 2, right? And omega we know is 2 pi by 5. Uh, well, we could write this in fractions. We can write 3.5 over 2 as 7 over 4. And the units are meters, okay and omega we have seen is equal to 2 pi by 5 so velocity will be equals to 2 pi by 5 times the radius which is 7 over 7 over 4 correct so which we can simplify and then write this as 7 over 10 pi meters per second right so that becomes the velocity for the wheel. In decimals, you can write approximately, this is actually the exact value, 0 0.7 meters per second. So that is how 0 0.7 pi meters, I missed that pi here, this is pi, 0 0.7 pi meters per second. So let me write down the answer clearly. Velocity equals to 0 0.7 pi meters per second. So in this fashion, you can answer the question with exact values. 
I hope that helps. Thank you. And all the best. The spelling of seconds will be seconds. Okay. I think that's fine. Thank you. And all the best.